So this is a Chinook helicopter, a big helicopter uh, that's used in the US military. And it is, I think it's pretty representative of what an actual Chinook looks like. So it's got these two big propellers up front. It's got this big cargo area in the middle. It's got a big cab up front for a large crew. And it can carry a whole bunch of stuff, uh, military equipment, and even can carry like Humvees and stuff by crane. So very useful, very useful helicopter in the military. I put it as brown and lighter brown because the one I had as a toy was a GI Joe set, and that was the camouflage colors that they used, which was brown and brown. Which you know, if you see something in the sky that's brown, I don't see how that's camouflage, but that's what it was. And that's how I built it. So let's go check out how I built this in less than five minutes of time and 221 pieces. Let's go check it out. Helicopter. How are we gonna do a big helicopter whereas a single helicopter was actually quite hard to build? Let's put five minutes on the clock and let's see how I build it. Okay, so so the big helicopter I have in my head is it's called the Chinook. So let's let's restart the clock and uh, start there five minutes at a time. Um, so I've always seen the Chinook as camouflaged, and I'm going to start off this general direction because last time it got very strange as to how we were supposed to build um, the helicopter. So I'm going to build it in this general direction. And then we're going to see how it turns out in comparison to what I did previously. Now, um, so the one that I think of when I think big helicopter is this Chinook helicopter. And the reason why is because when I was a kid, it was a GI Joe kit or playset, and it was the Chinook helicopter. I got it for Easter or for Christmas or one of those holidays. Um, that from like a grandparent, I believe, and it was very cool, very cool playset. Uh, played with it all the time. It was really big because GI Joe's six-inch figures were fitting all inside of there, uh, which was definitely a cool thing. Okay, so now maybe if I do this and that, and now I can put the cockpit in. There. That's not too bad. That looks like what, what it's supposed to look like. Okay, now I gotta figure out how to put some landing on there. So here wheels. Here's some wheels. How am I gonna do that? Sorry if you hear the so there, that's what we're looking for. Wouldn't be able to do that. Let's see. In the middle of the build. Oh, it's inverted even. That's not gonna work. Nope. Interesting. We've got a little bit of time left, so let's keep playing around with it until we get something that we like. Okay, so that that still looks like the Chinook that I'm thinking of. That's pretty cool. And then how do I build from there? How do I build a landing pad that's upside down? Ooh, that wheel goes upside down. But I don't have another... Ooh, I do have another set of these wheels. Ooh, can I do it that way? Maybe that's the trick. <laughs> it looks like a monster truck Chinook. But that's, that's the idea. Ooh, if I take the wheels off, 
it'll be less monster trucky and more military. Okay, so now let's try that. It falls apart very easily um, when you're building it on its side like that. But that's, honestly, that's the best. There it is! That's a Chinook helicopter made out of 221 pieces. I really enjoy that. I think that's dead on. I mean, the wheels are definitely still too big, right? I mean, the wheels are too big. What if I even take the wheels off? Nope. So there, I think that looks really cool. So this is um, a Chinook helicopter and it's got two big, um, what do you call it? Fan blades, propellers? I'm not exactly, I'm gonna call them propellers. It's got the cabin up front, big cabin uh, for, for a large crew. Then there's this big side opening uh, to carry military troops and or military gear. It also is so heavy duty that it can, you put a cable on the bottom here and then it can carry like tanks and stuff or at least Humvees. So it can be used as cranes, it can be used as all kinds of different things. And there you go, a Chinook helicopter for the bonus episode for Aviation Week. Looking pretty cool. I think it's pretty good. Leave a comment down below as to whether or not you think it looks like a Chinook. And if not, please tell me how you would have done it differently and maybe I'll incorporate those techniques into the next build. So now let's go check out what we're gonna build for tomorrow's five minute challenge. Go, let's, let's go check. Well, that was a cool build. Let's spin the wheel and see what we get for tomorrow's five minute challenge. Each and every day we do a five minute challenge. Uh, what do we got? A triplane. Um, the Red Baron used to have a triplane, three wings to his plane. That was a really cool plane. It's in the Snoopy show and it's been in a lot of different shows showing the Red Baron. It's even on a pizza plane. Um, so let's go build a triplane. Okay, tune in tomorrow for the triplane.